I think one of the most interesting things about being in surface imaging is this ability to use this printing technology and all sorts of materials that weren't ever intended as printed substrates. Printing on wall covering, films used for glass and glazing, rigid materials like wood, metals, plastics, uh, plastic resins that are used as architectural panels. Combining that image with the material itself and creating some really unique installations that help inspire really represent what that organization is trying to express about themselves. This is such a new field, nothing is established. So that if you are good, there are lots of possibilities, and that possibility is endless, and it is up to you so you can be one of the cutting edge surface imaging designers. For Google Motorola, this was a pretty extensive project that occurred over three or four months of production and installation, roughly a half million dollar project that included custom window film, lots of wall coverings, dimensional elements, uh, history panels that celebrated the history of Motorola. So probably about four or five material combinations over three different floors for a really successful headquarters for Google Motorola. As an employer, uh, it would be really great to be able to draw on a, a pool of people who had this degree of surface imaging so that we didn't have to spend as much time really learning on the job. So we're looking for somebody who's able to work with color, they can work with line, they can work with brush strokes, but they can also um, work with technology. The materials and what can be expressed, while at the same time marrying that with technologies. The opportunities are, are amazing and they're endless.